Okay, so here's an update. Uh, I have everything back together, most of the stuff. I gotta put that EGR valve on, which is right there. I'll just put this in right now. This piece. Oh, oh shit. It's hard to do this with one hand. Okay, that's in. Grab this napkin out the way. I'm gonna put that there. Uh, I have the little tube thing that goes from the intake to the uh, valve cover. I just gotta put the battery on. And that's about it. I also have um I also have under the car the H pipe on the right side. Um I have to uh connect it. It's not really connected, it's wedged between like the starter and stuff, but um it should be easy fix. It's not hard, it's only two bolts, if you guys know. Only two bolts down there. Uh I'm still gonna try to crank it and see if it uh starts over. I have the uh, crank, oh man, what's it called? Crank position sensor, I guess? I have that unplugged, so it could just, no, yeah, I don't know. I have one of these things unplugged. I think it's the crank position sensor. I have that unplugged, so it would be like a no crank start, and um, so I could get the oil up, oil, uh, oil pressure up and stuff, and uh, yeah. So in the next clip, I'll be starting it soon, so just give me one second. Uh, Alright, so the, um, I was recording this whole time, but um, I don't know. Um, I tried to crank the car. Let me just show you guys. I thought I was recording and I wasn't. Alright, so I got the key in. Everything comes on as usual. Um, but when I turn it, key, uh, everything dies. That's weird. I don't know what that. I have no idea what that can be. So. I'm just gonna keep make, looking around, make sure I have all the wires plugged in. I know the EGR thing is like right there. You can probably see it. It's right there. So, um, yeah. I'm just gonna keep trying and hopefully, um, hopefully it will crank over. I'm just gonna check wires and stuff. I don't know what it could be, to be honest. It's weird. Bruh, I am a idiot. I'm cranking a car over like it's a regular car. Like, no. I'm cranking the car. Actually, let me rephrase myself. I'm cranking the car like it's automatic. So, if you guys know what that means, I have to push the clutch in to turn the key. I mean, to turn the car on. So, I'm, it just blew. It, I don't know. I've been driving a few automatics since I haven't been driving this car. So, I forgot. It's standard. You got to push the clutch in, then turn the key. Bruh. This is like a what the fuck moment. All right, let's let's try this again, guys. Okay, third pedal. It's there. Can't forget. Foot on it. Push down the clutch. All right. Yeah. There we go, baby. There we go. That's the car right here, baby. That's the car I know, baby. The crank pulley, the crank positioning sensor is not plugged in, so it's not gonna crank over, but. I just want to do it to get the uh, oil pressure up, you know? That oil and stuff. Oh, my camera's about to die, but it cranks over. Just going to keep cranking it a little bit. Oh, my battery's going to die soon, man, but got to do it for the YouTube. Got the clutch in. <laughs> I'm so nervous, dude. My car sounds good, dude. I'm gonna look around under the car, make sure there's no oil leaks and shit. Shit pissing out everywhere. That's a good sign, man. That shit sounds good. It sounds fucking good, dude. It's a that's a good strong crank. So I'm just cranking it so the you know the oil could go through because I put I put fresh oil. I changed the oil and stuff. And um, this is a long ass clip. I'm sorry. It's about to be two minutes. But um, change the oil, let the oil circulate, get the oil pressure up and stuff like that. So I'm going to look around real quick. I got to charge my camera. So I'll see you guys in the next clip. It might be today. It might be tomorrow. It might be a little later. I'm not really sure. Um, so I don't know. But that's a good start, though. You hear it crank, though. It didn't blow up, baby. It didn't blow up, bitch. It didn't blow up. Ah! Okay, it's gonna be a click, uh, quick clip because uh, my camera's still gonna die. But as you can see, the oil, uh, 
pressure was kind of high. I guess not anymore, but uh, let's try to crank her over and uh, see if she starts. <laughs> Sound good. Oh man. Ah, I started. It doesn't show it has oil pressure though. I don't know. That's weird. It had full oil pressure, like uh it was in the middle and it keeps dropping. And I don't think this would tell me if um Okay. So I got the uh battery charged. Try this again, guys. It's freaking early, man. It's like, oh, not early, but it feels early. It's only 11. Okay. Let's see. Dang, it might be the starter. I might have cooked the starter. Fuck. Fuck me, dude. I might have cooked the starter, but I, was, I wasn't I even holding the starter that long, though. That's the crazy part. I was just cranking it over, cranking it over. I did it like three or four times, and they weren't long, so. My neighbor was right. He said it sounded like a, a, a starter issue. I'm fucked, bro. I do not want to change a fucking starter, dude. This is crazy. I'm about to wonder and just tap it a few times and see what happens, but dude. All I I should have just started the car. I was trying to be I was trying to oh my god. I was trying to have the oil pressure up in the car before actually cranking it over, get the oil through this through the engine, you know? And I guess I fried the fucking starter. I just can't win. I'm pissed, dude. I'm just gonna go under, type it a few times, and then try it again. If um, if it starts, I'll grab the camera. If not, I have no idea what to do, man. I'm pissed. So, unfortunately, the fucking engine is locked. Like, I'm gonna try one more thing and add some, um... Marvel mystery oil inside the holes and see if I can turn it by hand, but this thing is fucking locked, man. Just don't understand what 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 went wrong. I feel like fucking crying, man. Everything I fucking did, it's like for nothing. Spent over a thousand easily on this engine.